What is happening, y'all? This is Twilight Alpha, and I am returned. We have only a few order members left to hunt down. This is Assassin's Creed Valhalla, and the time is on. Okay, there we go. Is now. <clears throat> no more distractions. All that's left is to take these bastards down. For no good reason. Good people of Winchester, open your eyes. See how Alfred's lofty ideals are weighed down in this mire of human effluence. These prisoners before you do not live by Alfred's laws. They live above them. They wallow in shit, only guided by their own perversity. Hubert here, his wits addled by ale, spoke false of Bishop Aelforth, our pious servant of Winchester, who even now lies cold in his grave shroud. Aelforth was no man of God. He'll burn for his sins. Your wife is a baying shrew, Hubert. Is there a man here who has not supped rancid mead from her cup? When will your work be done, Selwyn? When all of Winchester falls to your justice? And now we have a third man on the, on the block. Winchester has passed judgment, Hubert. May God have mercy on your cankerous soul. else up top here but me. Ah, oh, that bastard's fleeing. Mm. Move, fool! There we go. Where's he going? Here we go. Okay, good. Now I'm getting caught up. Um, excuse? Hidden blade, fool! Do it! Oh shit. Combo, combo, combo! Oh no! I will kill you. Oh fuck. Uh, reload. You game. Yeah. I was supposed to be a freaking auto kill, but no. 
the random ass. Forgiveness. Okay, there it goes. I don't know why I targeted that one random dude. I was obviously going for the gallows. Maybe I should have just put him, put an arrow in him from a distance. I'm pretty good with a hunter bow. Maybe I should go with that instead. Anyway, that's how my day is going. How is y'all? Hope y'all doing okay thus far. Tuesday, so we still got a bit to go this week. There are rats in the grain store, and Alfred has set the traps. You cannot steal and be welcome at You cannot slander and kill. There's no longer freedom in Winchester. Alright, so it spared me the cutscene. I would have skipped it anyway, to be honest. And so I ask, who has the right to determine the fate of the pillar? I don't know if this will make a difference, but I'm gonna go hit up just because. You know what? Maybe I should have gone with a smoke or a, a sleep arrow instead. Might not be too. Oh, let me see. Oh, that was a poison arrow. Ah, oh, damn it. Actually, maybe. Oh, the guys are fleeing. Hmm, interesting. That's right, go, go, go ahead. Maybe it was a blessing in disguise doing the wrong thing. That's for sure gonna handle all the guards. Oh, did he see me? Maybe, but he won't get to me. He'll be dead by the time he makes a climb. Or should I just do him the favor? Nah, that guy. Dead. Alright. What? How is he not dead? Oh, did he seriously? You're kidding me. He re recovered from the poison just as it was about to finish him? Alright, there. He's done. Kind of like... That's insane, man. Perverter of justice, who dares execute the king's noose? It is not in Alfred's name that you carry out your work. You are the order's executioner. <laughs> you peer through the veil, but you do not see clearly. Alfred's laws are a slave's fever dream. He offers shit-soaked beggars a seat at his table. And? Where the meek devour the strong. Okay. Who best to judge the fate of the wretched many, if not the strong and worthy few? Well, there your question becomes who's... To protect your people, you must sheathe your hand with an iron glove. You grind your heels into the backs of freedmen, not those who deserve it. The Order condemns all men to pain. For all men are but a shadow of the perfection we should know. The perfection of the ancient ones. <laughs> okay. You are only a man, Reed. One dead branch on a fast dying tree. <laughs> you might be there a while. I should meet 
to it, Goodwin. See what he has found on the quill. Why does Alfred not do something? Wait, can I talk to this Selwyn's person? Selwyn's bloodlust will doom us all. Why does this person have a word bubble? Selwyn is dead. His lies poisoned everyone against us, and for what? Some only care for their own power and decision. I'm sorry I could not save your husband. My son is not an orphan today. You did more than enough. All right, so far so good. Yeah, they keep t these order members. Keep, when they die, they keep teasing something more. You know, you can't see the clear picture, or there's something that'll lose you. Blah 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 blah. blah. See, Alright, so Goodwin's still at the church. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, do you believe in souls? The part of us that lives on with God after we die. Yeah. Right, it's right on the other side of this wall. Oh, there's not actually a wall here. Okay. Willing to bet. Oh, cutscene. I did not expect that. Magister Batter not to teach you the scriptures? Magister Batter is a horse's dangles. <laughs> oh. Strong words. And here is the axe I used to swat a fly. <laughs> you have ventured from your burrow. And you have plunged my city into chaos. I had hoped you would use the lessons of your subtler gods. We have no subtle gods. That's a fact. If the gallows is truly dead, perhaps we can allow cautious revelry? Mm. I did only what I agreed to, Alfred. If your crown now weighs heavy, I would gladly take it from you. Mm -hmm. Well? Forgive my outburst. God sowed in me a passion, but English prose is an instrument long out of tune. <laughs> we all want better for our people, don't we, Eivor? Yours and ours. The quill remains. What do we know? The decay of learning has been gentle in Wessex. We enjoy the office of wise men, but we have neglected the study of wisdom. The quill preys on this lapse. Someone disagrees with your reforms, Alfred, and he is calling the children to arms. Now we know why so many children scurry through the streets, feral and untutored. I can talk to some, see where they lead me. Good. Find me at the alehouse when you're done, and try not to scare the piss from any of them. <laughs> we Norse are the monsters of your Saxon mother's bedtime tales. I promise nothing. <laughs> Fair. Yeah, that's a good point. I see you, child. Come. The bad Reeve, Selwyn. I saw you punish him in the square. He How? hurt many people. Yes. He hurt my mother to death. Then took her good luck charm. Perhaps you found it? A little carved tree. It is all I have to remember her by. Wait. Carved tree like the order? Such a sad story. Take this. Perhaps it will keep you off the streets and out of trouble. For me? Oh, thank you. Spry, little mouse. Mm -hmm. Will you lead me to your quill? Yep. Heaven will swallow the smoke of Aelfurt's pyre. Actually, the random lapse in movement might actually serve me okay here, as long as I don't far too fall behind. What's this? Get off me, you oaf! 
stop struggling and give back that apple. Apple? I didn't scrabble nothing. Get your fat hands off me, cowbreath. Cowbreath? You little street rat. No! Get off! Someone help me! No, she loved them when they were people. It's not been very um, Hello. You there, little cut purse. Keep your beak out, Nosy. I'm starving. Oi, you with the face. God's beard. You'll set Winchester ablaze. Roly poly mutton man. You can't catch me. <laughs> God help me. I'd rather be shoveling dung in Malvern again. Damn. I need to Be the right one. Make it past the guards. Oh, it's a river. Or a dock or something. Wait. Oh, okay. Found you. You again? You should mind your own beeswax. Elwyn, is it? You wield fire like the flaming Yotna. It, it was burning when I found it. Hot days like this, things just go whoosh. <laughs> well? Yep. Oi! Wigbert! You great moon calf. Moon calf? Hand it over, Alwyn. We saw your little shadow take it. What are you looking at? I have business with this child. Be gone. Turn around, walk away, and you keep your insides inside. All right, all right. No harm meant. Stay out of trouble, you grub mite. <laughs> You're dead. So glad I managed to complete all the fighting. <laughs> that showed them. Trouble seems to follow you. And I wriggle out of it like a slippery eel. Yeah, you're welcome. Why are you following me? Setting fires, stealing things. It's a fearful day's work. Aren't you supposed to be in lessons? You don't need book learning when you're street shrewd. That gets you real places. Or gets you noticed. By the quill, for example. Mm -hmm. Does he pay you well to do his dirty work? Us? Working for the quill? Shows what you know. Is that so? Those were the Quill's meat mops, and you sent them scurrying off with their tails between their legs. It sounds like you owe me your life. Yep. This one's brave and strong. Might be able to help us. So you're not working for the Quill? We steal to stay alive and out of the Quill's clutches. But you know where I can find him. Interesting. They come up from the sewers like rats. Go on, give him what you took. Maybe he can save us. Save? What do you mean save? Ooh. A key. Good luck, Dane. Try not to get maimed and all that. <laughs> so is near the river. Hilda. The 
church was no place for a woman of intelligence. This was a lesson Hilda learned early in life. Orphaned at six, she found a monastery. While a young male in initiate spelled days studying in Paris, she was brandished to the kitchen. She listened in doorways, hiding in shadows, and blackmailing monks with secrets. As not only they teach her important things, reading, writing, and Latin. In the church, her vivacious intelligence was her undoing. In the order, it was a revelation. Bishop Elfarth saw value not only in her sharp wit, but her ruthlessness. She quickly built a network of children like herself, quick and sharp. Small hands, quick to steal, and small ears, quick to listen. No secrets in Winchester were safe from the Quill's army of little spies. So I'm, I've got one, two, three, four members left. The clock is ticking. So the, I guess my next question is, why isn't Eivor just an assassin? Like, he might as well be, for all intents and purposes. Aid me. Be my eyes. Because he isn't technically, as a, if I'm not mistaken, I don't think he's technically part of the Brotherhood. I should watch out for a mouse trap. And <laughs> no traps gonna mouse me. Wait, what? <laughs> Bitch. Stabby, stabby, stab, stab, stab. Hmm? Who's that? What you doing? I'm warning you. That's all fine and good, but I'm killing you. <laughs> So far, it's, uh, I'm going the right direction. Must have been quite an explosion to blow a hole through this guy. More chitlins. Something worth interacting with is down here. But I see Oh wait, cutscene. Hmm. The apples? That's her! Dimwit Dane, Dimwit Dane, didn't guess the quills are she. Now, now, Elwyn. Few have the wit that you and I possess. Most see the world in simpler terms, where we are the weaker sex. A brood mare who preys on innocence, mm -hmm. and you brag about strength. <laughs> How little you know. Where's your Defend sharp tongue your now? Seriously. That's not good. Except you win. This is the best you can do. Slippering away. What's the matter, huh? I thought you were uh, the stronger sex. Why are you fleeing? Not confident? Hail for the spruce. Does she flee to the bishop's house?
see, where are you hiding? Oh, damn it, I wasn't trying to... Well, I guess I'm past the initial wave of guards. Not, oh yeah, you, now you're wanting me to come out, huh? Guards, protect me! I thought you were strong. This heathen will kill us all. to climb up this statue here, but I'm sure they would notice me if I did. Oh, come on! Now the game wants to... God. Now my controller decides it doesn't want to fucking function. My controller decides to spaz out right the literal worst possible time. Perhaps a blessing in disguise, because now... close, but if he doesn't look up, it don't matter. Oh, she's dead. Good. Actually, so is most of her escort as well. That guy will be following soon. Oh, that guy got poisoned too. I didn't expect that. Alright, I'll take it. children to spy and steal for your order. Yep. To educate them. Uh-huh. Give me a child until you're seven, and I will give you the man. Or woman. What use are letters when a child can only write his name in pig shit? Or wisdom in a woman when she cannot wield it beyond her heart? I taught little Alwyn so much more. Saved her from a life less worthy. She will find enlightenment in the Order, just as I did. If I could save them all, I would. But you cannot. You have corrupted too many to save too few. That's a fact. forward. It can quench our thirst for knowledge. If only Alfred's slave faith is defeated. And what would you sacrifice for infinite knowledge? A 
an immeasurable gift. Why refuse it? Depends my cost. And also, you're also bold to assume not that. their innocence. Gone now, and your time is up. A pity. Non requiescat in pace. Oh, interesting. No rest in peace, she says. Set to meet him at an alehouse nearby. Oh, that guy's coming to poison. Good. Or it doesn't matter now. I have eight, nine mastery points. Damn. So good. Oh, we're way out there. Okay. Anyone else ever had a thought and then they lose it immediately? Or is that just me? Drives me crazy. I'll be in the process of thinking something and then poof, it's gone. Ooh, lay off the alcohol. You think you can guzzle the grog? Prove it! Where's the toes is to brawl? Back alley brawlers, is that what they're calling it now or something such? The shimmer of your silver, friend. All right. Bend the whole big. hoard. Go big or go home. We drink. And I'm not looking to go back to Ravensthorpe so soon. All right, here we go. One down, that's not bad. Good start. I'm expecting I'm expecting to start Peter in here soon. Oh, this is weak stuff. Oh, oh there it goes. There it is. I notice there's a distinct lack of tossing on my part. Yep. Happy me. 
Is this where Justice hides when she's tired? <laughs> hides? Splood, no. This is a wake, my friend. A celebration to ease the quill on her way to eternal damnation. <laughs> you heard. Hilda's were not the only eyes in Winchester. My spies tell me stories of an avenging angel striking down the unworthy. I like it. I've been called worse. <laughs> Be thou hail, Eldorbana. That's life destroyer in our dialect. I sat easy with my kinsmen, old honey waves alive in my horn, and my eyes on the door, expecting my death, yet unafraid. <laughs> You're quite safe with me, Dane. For now. For now? If the mead is fresh and the air is cool, you may often find a friend even amongst your enemies. <laughs> Makes sense. Let me taste like that. Oh, don't be mean. I could use someone like you in my settlement. Yeah, throw the ink on his fingers and a sense of honor. I would love to devote myself to the study and practice of the law. There is a weariness in war I wish I could shake off. Impossible. Even in death, our battles will rage on. It is the way of things. I must mm. thank you before the ale dulls me. Right. By cutting the order down to size, you have given England a hope of unity. It must be a sour apple to swallow, knowing that you are the last of Winchester's enemies. Uh, uh, yeah. Are you sure the Sikhs is dead? The bishop is dead, that's certain. And if the bishop was the Sikhs, the Sikhs is dead. A transitive property of mortality, you see. I do not believe it. Too much steered in Winchester. Overwrought prayers and wailing women. Well, you could pay your respects and see for yourself. The funeral is today. If he rots, I will leave with my silver. But if he lives, there's work to be done. Watch your step, Abel. He'll be a hefty corpse in death. Alive, he'd be much bigger. Hmm. Whether you find or make it, meet me at the Witten with your report. Alright, let's see if, uh, what the details are. The actual truth of this matter. Or Eivor is unconvinced the man is dead. Now that said, this does assume that it isn't that the bishop is indeed the six. Because if the bishop is not the six, and that's what I'm willing to bet, I'm willing to bet he's. This is, I don't know whether he's not dead or a different person. If the bishop is worm meal, then here should be the proof. Right, let's poke around then. Do you know Bishop Elba? No, but I plan to write an epic poem of his grisly demise. Oh, poor Aelfeth, scorched of face. All your woeful companions, bold, bionid, weeping. Weeping as you are, uh... Sleeping. Oh, perfect, yes. A sad day for Winchester. Maybe now God will reward us with a man who truly believes in him. Hmm. Truly believes, so you don't, you think the, this guy seems to think that the bishop might not be genuine. Interesting. Such a grisly fate. Did you know Elfa? By reputation, I did. He was no friend of Alfred's. I once had them quarreling into Witten. Do you not see? I am in prayer. May we speak of your brother's death? Have you no shame? Leave me. I know the burden you bear. Such a weight of sin you have taken on. And all for your brother's sake. I know he lives. No, he's... He said it was for the good of all. He... I am his loyal sister, and I tell you, he is dead. You hear me? Hmm. Dead. Maybe she doesn't know. Leave me alone. I cannot betray my brother. Guards, protect me! 
Oh, fine, we're doing this. Huh? Why do you get a you? Wounds on the back are a swordsman's shame. <laughs> well, I guess I don't have to do the rest, do I? Hey, you with the face, I'm not dead. Your guards suck. Why can't I? There we go. Why will you not leave me alone? Enough of this, cat and mouse. Where's your brother, the one they call the Sikhs? He is a ghost now. But he will make himself flesh once more of the Witten. And Alfred will be king no more. He means to kill Alfred. Regicide? No. The king will step aside and Aelfeth will lead us all. <laughs> risen and resplendent as the Lord. You are a damned fool. Alright, we're gonna kill this bastard for real this time. Oh, what's up, Rita's? But alas, I do not have the time. Go. Nice. Alright. Find us an order, man. I'm gonna kill him. What? The man's well guarded? No way. In the past, Anglo Saxons prospered. The Sikhs must be hiding in the crowd, biding his time to strike at Alfred. can turn the letter of their sermons from Latin to English. And how can we understand God's words if they are not spoken in our tongue? Aelferth is dead, and we mourn him. But the foul deeds of the unrighteous are sown among our holy deeds, like cockles and tear in a field of wit. Education, wisdom, enlightened thought, this will raise us above the sins of our How fathers. Do I know These I will demand of the next Bishop of Winchester. And so we meet to discuss all worthy candidates and choose the man who will shepherd our flock. The king is mine! By God, it's true. The bishop lives. Stand down, Goodwin. Oh, so it's a boss battle then. Damn it, I picked What are you defending this tarnished crowd? Scheming car! The rest of you have died on my side. Out of my there we go. No, he looked at me and died. Just, uh, I couldn't stand my. I'm just too handsome. Couldn't stand the, the whole thing. It's too much for him to bear. How sweet is the shepherd's pipe when he calls his lambs to slaughter. I was born to Christians in the northern wilds. My mother would cradle me beneath the stars and whisper, dove-like, God watches over you. Then your people came, and God fixed his stout eye as they slit her throat for a copper ring. No stars threw down their spears as barbarians smeared her blood through fields of broken wheat. So I'm longer right. God watched all. And I hated him. Mm. 
It may be Alfred's God was testing you. A trial you Arthur, failed. Alfred's God is weak. Yet he would chain us all in his service from our first breath to our death rattle. Arthur. My order wishes to break these mind forged manacles. I am the wolf in Lamb's Wool. He takes on the role of a god himself. A worthy man to walk. A wolf is but a walking feast for ravens. Indeed. One more gift for you, Dane. A deadly truth, if you can find it. What does that mean? With my death, the Order will not die. It will only transform into something far worse for all of us. Firth will not cheat Loki's dread daughter twice. I owe you my life. An irony not lost on me, Alfred. <laughs> my king, we'll go by back streets to the old minster. Eivor may find us there when all has settled. Served God. No. He tried to kill you. He king. wrapped himself in a death cloak to murder your king. Shouldn't you rejoice at the death of a king? You are a heathen and a devil. We both have more questions than answers. But if you know this key, perhaps we can help one another. <laughs> is that a glitch? There's no Where key. is its home? You treated me with kindness, but this damned order. Their machinations killed my brother, so the rest may rot. Take this key to the ruins beneath oh, the bishop's house. You may find answers there. I was not expecting it soon. Interesting. St. Mark's Church in Canterbury and Kent. A view full of gone sour send bales with. Not ring at the insistence of her father. However, she found a new love, the Order. She pursued this precept of the Order with a continuing passion and rise to the level of Magister. So she will end up being the Sikhs. And then, like, after that, it's, there's one other higher member than her left, and then after that, it's just the father, whoever the father may be. Oh, I hope it's not Sigmund. Because when this all started, the, uh, <clears throat> the prophecy said that we would end up fighting. I hope that's not what it meant. He was with Falke for a long time. But if they're gonna brainwash him, why would they chop his arm off?
Maybe not. It might be more. The decree, universal decree, for this 870th year of the Christian Jesus. Over England against the agitators. I'll send this to Hytham. He may make some sense of it. She lost great fortress upon this earth. All ancient rivals from the 4th century. Okay, now we face a new threat. Ravenous Danes have not yet accepted our supremacy. We must fight them, turn them, or eliminate them. Though in battle, I was next in Francia and Ireland. Stand ready to my glorious return. Be ever resolute. Though our order may diminish, our truths are eternal. I from the Father. So that was the easy one to find. There's apparently one more. That's a little more obscure. Oh wait, here it is. This must be it. How did I miss it? Mark Alfred weathered spring from his trunk. Should have seen earlier as a for poor soldiers colluding with our king and feeding Everything him. they did was to undermine Alfred. She lied to me. There's nothing here of the order. I should see Alfred for my reward. So maybe she is the sea? I thought she. The, we ha I was here to kill the seas. Wait, hang on. Let me check. Oh, uh, yeah. The Archbishop Shadow. The ring, not the seeks, right. But she lied. Or I was lied too. Actually, can I go back to it? I'm gonna go back to the order real quick. Mark, there we go. That's what I thought I was doing. Oh yeah, way the hell over there. Damn, all right. <clears throat> I'm doing me a warp real quick. that I had that. I found, I, uh, I bought a second copy of uh, Arkham Knight. I don't know if it'll be worth anything, but it might be, if I'm lucky. Which I'm not, so it'll probably won't be worth jack. We'll see. Well, now. Well, well. Die! 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 I 
wonder if this will end up Should reveal right for no. So it'll, it'll give me the fifth clue out of six. If I'm assuming I'm correct. Blah 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 That's all I hear. Dumb fools. Have a look soon in there. Oh wow, she's way the hell over there, okay. coming. <clears throat> the Archbishop never suspected my heresy. I kept secrets as I gathered believers. I appeared so pious my eyes bled for him. But I've never felt as much love for his God. Not like I do the old gods. The true gods. Our ancient creators. Your life was a lie, you mean. You threw your honor into the ocean. When I told the Archbishop my true belief, he was horrified. So I silenced what? him. No. That silence comes for you now. Yep. I'm guessing she's... Oh, I assume she's talking about the first two? I don't know. That'd be my guess. Down in. And now I'm probably gonna want to warp back. So I shouldn't have five. Yep, I was right. All right, yeah. So that gives me the fifth out of six, which means I'm probably gonna come across the next one soon. Probably either this next quest mission. Or the following would be my guess. The question is, how long will I have to wait for this? Oh, it's load screen. Hang on. Also, hang on. Oh, there it goes. Okay, good. That was weird. Oh, shit! Not dead! Oh. Alright, I did not see that coming. I thought I was toast for sure. Like, burn. Straight up. Alright, so is he inside the building? That's not the door. I'm not sure if he's inside the building or not. Can I get inside the building? That's like probably the better question. I don't know that he is. So I'm gonna go around first. I probably... 
No, no, I think he is in. I just need to find the door. There we go. There it is. Good. So this upcoming battle, oh, I assume it's a battle. It might not be, but I'm, if there is an upcoming battle, I might actually have to use a potion for this one. Come forth, Eivor. Here is far enough. <laughs> when wrongdoers came to devour my flesh, these enemies stumbled and fell. Maybe Alfred's... It doesn't make sense. Why would he be the father? Have the laws of hospitality been thrown out, Alfred? I did exactly as we agreed. That you did. But do not mistake necessity for friendship. You are a man of your word, a man of God. Indeed. By his example, I live my life. Goodwin. Here is the only silver fit for one of your dragon boats. A reminder of Christ's sacrifice and our charity. This too I offer you. Live here among us in peace as a Christian, or die a pagan in a blood-soaked field. All you have to lose is life everlasting. And if I choose neither? He offers you hope, Eivor. A life of purpose, above and beyond this one. You'd be a fool to refuse. Your reign will end, King of the West Saxons. Raven wings will beat until your throne crumbles to dust. You were wrong, Goodwin. This one is beyond saving. So, you want to do the fighting here and now? Can we at least step outside first? Lock me in and try and burn it down. You had your chance, damn you! I did not want it. I kind of like that guy. I hope I don't have to kill him. Damn you, Alfred. I will return to Hytham and Ranmi. They will want to know what happened here. Oh, our complete is so well. I actually failed... Failed to gain the ally. I assume that's uh, intended. Getting tired, are you? If I were you, I'd be tired of sucking at life, but that's just me. Alright, hopefully I can warp at this point.
gonna be one of those long ones. I can see. All right. Stop it. They want to come and try to take Raven's sword, and they're welcome to, but it ain't gonna get very far. I wonder if this. Oh, actually, this probably won't be good for Raventhorpe's reputation. And the should... Order in Winchester has been wiped out, but we are no longer welcome there. My contact was none other than King Alfred himself. The Order wanted him dead, so he fought back. Alfred, the line between friend and enemy is a porous one. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, now what? Apparently, I can't talk to her. Huh. Interesting. Something happened. Oh, here we go. Uh, that, uh, that delay had me a little bit nervous. Road to Valhalla. <laughs> See what they did there. Still. Definitely feels like we're in, definitely in the end game now. Is he inside? Then why couldn't I see him? Or maybe he hadn't loaded in yet. Part of the delay, perhaps. Has that door been there? What the fuck? Eivor, the time has come. Our time. Our time for what? Yeah, what do you mean? My final glory awaits. Your final glory? I fear to ask what that means. Do I not speak plainly? My time in Midgard is done. I wish now to see the hall of my ancestors. If you wish to die, it will not be by my hand. I do not speak of death, Eivor. I speak of life. Life and glory everlasting. I know I've been in a fog these last few weeks. I know I speak words you don't fully understand. But I only ask you trust me once more. On my final voyage back to Norway, to wish my father farewell and achieve my destiny. Back to Norway? I need to discuss this with Ranvi. If you must. I will await your answer down by the docks. Do not keep me waiting. Uh, I, I don't like this. I like it not. I want to see the Alliance map. It may be time to return to Norway. Sigurd is eager to see his father and... and beyond that, I do not know. I have heard ill news about Styrbjorn in the past year. If you go, go with care. Go. We will leave now and return as soon as we're able. Good. And be safe, both of you. Right. 
One more kiss for the road, huh? Shall we? Please, Eivor. Mm. Yeah, I don't think so. I should go. I wonder if you break up with her, what that looks like. I wonder if you can get back together. The Wolfka. So glad to see you. fight with one arm though. Surely he doesn't actually partake or doesn't intend to partake in battle. Sigurd, shall we then, Eivor, to Norway and well beyond? To Norway then. Good, good. Lead on. Stop that. Not bad. So strange. Little has changed, but it feels unfamiliar. A few years abroad have shaped us more than all the decades we spent here, brother. It's yeah. bloody cold. Colder than I remember. Oh no, he's gotten too acclimated to the different temperature. When you go from a colder climate to a warmer climate, and you stay there too long. It's harder to go back. Fair hair's kingdom now. Every peak and fjord. It pains me to say it, to think it even. Mm. And our father is full, poor man. It is a road he chose. He bent easily and broke in half. Do not pity him. No. For many moons I could not sleep, always thinking of his betrayal. The horrors I wished upon him. He deserves nothing but shame now. Put it out of your mind, Sigurd. There's no need to hound the old man. No. no. He must taste the same foulness that I taste. He must know what glory he missed by staying here, the lap dog of a conqueror. You want to speak with him? Yes. Face to face. I will tell him the truth. What truth is that, I wonder? I suppose we'll know when as soon as we see the cutscene. Studs. It thrives, in spite of our father, no doubt. Are you sure of this? I will say what needs to be said. Do you fear his rebuke? Oh no, I crave <laughs> it. Certainly, I was gonna say not anymore. Certainly. It may be the old hound has lost his Maybe you will light a fire beneath him, inspire him with tales of our glory. If I do, I'll stoke that flame until it burns. the ship here. We can continue. Oh, I figured with yeah. me. What was it Randy said? Our father spends his days in the night of wood. That's right. We'll search the mead halls. I remember one nearby. A sad hole where men soak their unhappiness. There. Come empty-handed. Not even a gift to Rats offer. Rats don't appreciate gifts. Damn. They sniff and lick. Without care. 
You are chipper, brother. <laughs> when I see a drinking contest, that's probably a good sign. Uh, I don't know what this is. Armory, perhaps? Well, I thought that was a drinking contest. Oh, there's that. Um... Once, just once, I'd have him take a bath. <laughs> he was a king once, that one. You'd never oh. know by the way he sulks. That sounds like him. Think you can swill with the best? We should go. Look at him. Father. Odin's blessing, come and let me look at you Stop. both. That is far enough. Blood of cheer. What happened there? A grievous wound you have. Are you well? Far better than I look, I assure you. Mm. This, awesome. this calls for a toast. Your journey must have been long and cold. A drink to warm your blood. We are not here to drink or make merry. Only to look upon the rackets of a once great man. And then what? Make new war against King Harald? Stake a claim on his crown? Is that your wish? To sow more chaos here? <laughs> You're absurd, old man. What could possibly Damn. interest me in this frozen backwater? Interest you? You robbed me of my wealth when you left for England. I presume you would do it again. Not my idea. You left us with nothing when you pledged for King Harald. Yeah. We took only what we deserved. <laughs> I have returned for one reason only. To say goodbye. And to thank you for your colossal failure. Failure? Yeah. As a father, as a king, as a man. For without it... I would not have discovered my true self. My failure, as you call it. My oath to King Harald was the only sensible path forward for a man in my situation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What have you done with yourself since? Drink heavily and weep for what might have been? I have... I have worked hard to broker peace across our land, to spread Harald's message of unity. I heard you sleep beneath Harald's bed, always at his back and call, and that he uses your gaping mouth as a chamber pot. You make light <laughs> of my service to a great and powerful man. Is that how you treat those who serve you, Sigurd? You pathetic work! Oh, come on, man. Sigurd, this is not why we came. Plans change. As do hearts. Not this one. And you, Eivor? Um... I didn't trust us. You should have told us of your plan to bend the knee to Harald. And spared me the shame of seeing my father debase himself like a gutted pig. You are right. I owed you the truth, and for that I am sorry. But I will not apologize for what I did. Then I have nothing left to say to you. My son, please! Uh, 
Ah, let him go. You've spoken your words, and Sigurd has heard them. There's nothing left to say. What happened to my son? What turmoil did he see that took his arm and darkened his mood? He saw his father for what he truly was. A coward who faced his enemies with more honesty than he did his family. I was a father to you, Eivor. I... I have no father. Damn. This sad business is finished. And good riddance. And now we sail for further shores. To my true purpose. To my destiny. To the end of my road. I will follow you as far as you wish in this world, brother. But if you mean to take us further, I may reconsider. <laughs> I do not think you will, Abel. I think you will marvel at what I have to show you. And what is that exactly? Still dwelling on your father. Not at all. I was only reflecting on my visions, wondering at them, how present they are, like memories of yesterday. Definitely feels more clear-headed than he has. Describe them for me, your visions. My earliest was of a large door embedded in ice, far north of Hördafilk. The saga stone embedded at the top of its arch. Mm. As the visions grew stronger, the door opened, revealing many things. The life tree Yggdrasil, the golden fields of Valhalla, and the faces of our gods. All of whom called me friend, brother, warrior. I felt at home among them, warmed by their love. You should know, you are not alone in this. I too have had visions. And yeah, less un... Have you? Less settling. And what did they foretell? It is hard to say. I've seen Odin leading me into shadows. I've seen spinners weaving wild destinies from pools of blood. I saw the great beast Fenrir, the branches of the world tree, and the man with... Go on. Valka warned me of a great betrayal, but what form it takes I cannot say. I see. I hold to my oath, Sigurd. You know that. Betrayal is not in my nature. Of course not. You are a stalwart as a pillar of stone. Uh, Come now. My destiny awaits. Uh, somehow I feel like we're suddenly treading on thin hey! ice. Let's go. Here's the northernmost fjord. Okay. Let me check the map. I guess I must be that way. The daughters of I here bless our passage. Yes. I feel a great calm as we cross these ways. This ordeal with the elf king, Alfred. How far elf have king? you pushed him? Does he bend? Will he break? Guthrum's army will be chasing him across Wessex now. With luck, he will push Alfred into the sea. Strange how these earthly concerns seem so distant to me. Christians are hardy folks. They see one man above who holds the axe. One man higher than us all. That is a powerful few. We hold our own axe. We swing it where we may. That's true. A woman, Fulke. In my time with her, as painful as it was, she showed me things. Things so strange and wonderful, I am almost grateful for her treachery. What she did to you was cruel beyond measure. Damn straight. Yet, with every snap of the flame, with every scar the loss of my arm, my visions grew stronger. If you can find the good in that, fine. She was as mad as the ocean. That's was. true, 100%. Even the mad ones can offer wisdom. Their Jesus was an odd fellow. Now half the known world loves him. And no one believed us when we were young, 
and we chiseled our plants onto tables in meat halls. <laughs> not even my father. There is the secret I know well. Can we not return to England and finish together what we began? No, no forget all that. The future is forward. A great wealth awaits us. I'm with you, brother. Until the end. Oh, is that all? I was expecting more. Sail out! Alright, I think I got it right. Let me let me check it. Yes, good. Alright. Although apparently I took the narrower path because reasons. Gonna have to call it soon though. Almost out of time. Good for today. A white rage stands in our way. Keep moving forward! Do you know the way? As I know my own mind! We will cut through this winter sheet like swords through straw! Do not worry! To Paris and a lonely fjord! We'd be the shame of our clan! Aye. Ah, that we would! No winter blizzard's gonna fell the two of us, though. I can promise you that. <laughs> We're way stronger than that. Alright, so we've reached the, the horde, although I guess it'd be more accurate. Yes, yes this feels familiar. Amor, we will press on. The rest of you, wait here. I guess it'd be, although it might be more accurate to say to reach the shore of the northern north fjord. No horse access. Ominous. Follow me into this kingdom of snow. Sigurd, can we not wait for this to pass? Ah, the sting of ice and skin. Revel in this, Eivor. We walk the footpath of the gods. To where? More glaciers and deserts of snow? <laughs> to glory! Could we not wait until this tempest quiets down? With a ship, where we have mead and food to warm us. No, we must confront the omens and honor the gods. They will not seek or find you. We must go to them. We would be poor company, with frozen bones and ice pellet eyes. <laughs> That's true. You need not fear the cold, Eivor. Where we are going, the winds and snows cannot touch. Oh, he wants to sit, take me with him. Through this mystery door into Valhalla. Maybe I should wait for him. Ah, uh, it's as bitter cold as wind from Niflheim. Keep steady. It should not be far now. Or that, or he might be leading me to some. Establishment of the long forgotten temple of the first sieve, that's possible. I assume this is where he's leading me, it doesn't look like I can go anywhere else. He appears to have stopped. Why stop? Oh, I guess he periodically will randomly stop if you're not close enough to him. That's good. But yes, I was right. This it must be near! I know the shape of these rocks! Yes! We are close! For the sake of frozen fingers! <laughs> I hope so! I mean, seriously, for real. Frostbite's a, a genuine threat right now. At best. What is this place? Yeah, besides the frozen wasteland, obviously. I'm here. Don't worry, you have my attention.
still, I gotta, you gotta admit, there is a, a haunting beauty. So these mountains, actually, I think it's a tunnel. Or a cave, rather. Well, at least he doesn't have to worry about his right hand getting frostbite. <laughs> Boy in hell. The ice looks fragile. Can you clear it? That's, that's a yes. Ice cave. I feel like I'm stepping into Jabu Jabu's shrine back at uh, Come along, Zora's neighbor. domain. Why did he wait? Why did he stop? In the ice cave. My heart races. Yep, I was. This is it. Gods. This door. So the first. Have you seen this before? The space above. The Saga Stone sat there. They did not. Long, long ago. Yes. Now stand clear. Svachoi nogvat unsh membro trurvon di gvorde. Un solas vras gnocadide, un sum hugas reis derae, gas saunsi. How did you do this? Where did you learn these words? What do they mean? I told you, Eivor. My visions are memories of a life once lived. Come. Gods. What is this place? will lead us onward. Oh, that quest marker got us a severe drop in FPS for a second. Brother's Keeper, the name of the quest. That doesn't bode well. Is there some sort of elevator? That would be a yes. gonna die. I don't know what to say. This is all so strange. Trust this place, Eivor. This old and sacred place. Where does it lead? To the Hall of the Slain, the Golden Fields. To Valhalla. Can't go to Valhalla. We have responsibilities yet. Ravensport. People count on us. Supposed to be just me? Oh, this is some sort of new load screen. I'm not sure what's happening here. Oh no, there he is. There! The old tree! The tree of life! What is this? See how proudly she sits, how beautiful she gleams. Here all the roots of life run together. The skulls would cry to behold such a sight. Yeah. And there is more to come. I swear by all the names of the Old Father, this is only a taste of what I have in store for you. Oh. My visions go further, to Odin's great hall. Big talk. There. Do you feel that? The sacred energies. I have never seen something so grand. This shrine is ours. It will open for us. Watch and see for yourself. How do you know these things? Was all this in your vision? All this and more. 
looks like tech. It doesn't look natural. Sigur? Why did you stop? Oh, waiting for me, I guess. Okay. I think this is part of the first sieve. The architecture looks the same. I can't believe this is an actual tree, obviously. It has barbed points? That does No, something's wrong. Yes, it is returning to me now. This ancient shrine is set alight by the sphere of metal. Yeah, that is that. that. And these shining arms, these branches, they will grant us access to the refuse of the gods, to Valhalla. Are you ready? Um. Sigurd, take great care. We should not yeah. tinker with the tools of the gods. Oh, there's you someone already there. For yourself, Abel. For I am no mortal. I see that now. I know it. Take your place at the center there, and you will see. <clears throat> Alright, I don't have a choice. I didn't notice that body hanging from the side before, though. Should I recognize that body? Is this some sort of... What the... Oh, is this some sort of... Ancient animus? Hill you give us, the guest is coming. What is happening right now? I think they just went for you here. Yeah, I, that'd be my guess. <laughs> they went full industrial illusions. <laughs> that's assuming that's correct. That's funny, but I don't know. Like I said, whoa. Now where am I? I'm not actually back home. Obviously, this must have been the inspiration for the Animus, whatever this device is. This place. Sort of dream. And I'm animus within an animus. <laughs> Animusception. Oh, is it for Hall? Oh no, I'm Javi now. We are proud to serve you, Javi. So I guess I'm Odin again. My lips with another horn of mead, brother. Drink for strength, fight for glory. Eivor, Tyr said you would come. Welcome. Are you... Are you Valka's mother? Swala? But I'm not. You have a keen eye, Wolfkist. After all this time, Eivor, we have arrived. Now raise a horn with Freya here and sing a victory song. Sigurd, what is all this? Oh, I didn't even your notice. Your has returned, and your vicar as well. Glory eternal, Eivor. Here we dine in the great hall of the slain. At long last. Oh, I want to scream with joy. But it's joy. not real. This is... This is all so beautiful. It is. Your visions were... They were real. The battle of blows! Come, dear! To the field! Fight with us! Go, Eivor. Enjoy the fight. You have earned your place here. Alright, let's go. Damn. 
Whoa, one shot, one kill. All right, I'm down. Alright, that was pretty badass. Oh, so my adrenaline still works as normal. Alright. Incredible! Enough with those short flies. You and I must fight. The battle we never had. And hold nothing back. For here we need not fear a thing. Alright then. Spill the eternal blood of Valhalla. At last, I share the skill of infinite battle with a true. <laughs> Oh, I don't, I'm, I don't take damage. Interesting. Oh shit. Brother, worry not, Aver. <laughs> we earn no scars here. Only battle wisdom. Okay, he's done. What just happened? This is what is this, Groundhog Day now? Definite deja vu. Oh, his hand's back. That's good. Sigurd, your arm has grown back. It was never gone, Eivor. Not truly. Nothing is permanent here. I told you. Nothing save the courage and reputation of its warriors. Are we immortal in this place? <laughs> Let us discover that together. New battle. Ah, <laughs> Damn. Bye, Felicia. Tomorrow's bed. Again, you've lost your arm. Same arm. I can't be. Interesting that it's only his right arm that seems to be lost. That can't be a coincidence. Father, is that you? Oh. I gotta find him. Alright, so 20 bucks says we're gonna end up. Waking up back in bed. Yep. Called it. That cannot have been my father. Now, wasn't my father cut down in the middle of a Celebration. Skull! Skull! Take 
Take your horn. Join the battle cheer. Oh, my hands back again. Dearest skull, the war and verse. How do you like this frenzy so far? It is. It is quite something. Raise your horn, Eivor. What stops you? My father, Varin. Have you seen him in this hall? I have not. Should he be here? Why wouldn't he be? No, he died a coward. Oh, yeah. Yet by Odin's eye, I swear I've seen him. Cast aside your cares in Valhalla. Let seeking go. We have earned our joy. The journey is complete. I have to keep expecting by half to have a, a response decision. I saw you, father. Where are you? Show yourself. That, or perhaps he didn't die a coward after all. Perhaps. <laughs> perhaps it's not so simple. Great warriors, have you seen Varin? Who? Varin, my father. Yesterday is gone. Tomorrow never. Varin, father. Oh, no. is that him in the front? It's just tried to swing at me. I mean, apparently I'm invincible, so that's not a problem. How far out can I go? Can I go out into the water? Oh, it just not only it just doesn't go. Interesting. <laughs> that I was Wait. Father? Ow. Oh. Damn. Right in the eye. What's up with the horn? Well, am I supposed to recognize what that symbol meant? And at the top of the gate? I feel like I'm supposed to know, but I don't. Either because I'm an idiot, or because I don't know the mythology. Or both. It's very possible. Oh, I got my eye back. That's good. Oh, shit. Hey, boy. You have a guest. You should have knocked first. Nonsense! I brought you someone. Look! My Eivor! There you are! What a warrior you have made of yourself! I am overfilled with pride. How did you find your way here? You remember our great battle? You remember how we fought, side by side? With your mother and Sigurd and our clans united. We fought, father. But you did not. Yeah. You died a coward. Eivor, enjoy this. Your father has returned. <laughs> Have you lost all your love for life? That was not my father. That was a lie. That was not a lie. That was my gift to you. I have power here, and I can do as I please. 
You wished to see your father. I made it happen. As easy as breathing. By Odin's laws, my father is not allowed in this place. I do not wish to see him where he should not be. Your father died doing what he hoped would save you. He died to protect you mm -hmm. and his clan. That's still true. No. He... This is the end of our road, Eivor. This is Valhalla, the eternal golden field. Now come. Battle beckons. I've got a bad feeling. How is all this possible? Notice how the hall is empty, or did I miss the start of the battle? Hmm. <laughs> it offers a marker, but I guess to sit? But I, I don't think that I can. That's weird. Something fishy is going on here. I mean, obviously, of course. The slain brought here. The Valkyries know this. Only them. No, that cannot be true. None of this feels right. Do not despair, Eivor. Look, your friends are here. Everyone you could ever want is here beside you. This is not Valhalla. This place can be whatever you wish it to be, Eivor. I do not want it. Not like this. You would resign yourself to an empty death? The ecstasy I feel here is an illusion. I would sooner call like a raven than sing a false song. Illusion or not, here there is no death, no pain, no loss, no betrayal. Not like out there. You want this? Again. To live inside a lie? I am an old woman with a broken body. What life mm. I had left was brief. So I bid farewell to my dear Volka and came here. I wish you well, Swala. <laughs> but this is not for me. Must find Sigurd. Yeah, I think this is like a ancient civilization animus. Oh, he's not on the rock. Though I'm glad that my uh, stamina or my adrenaline reloads every time. That's gonna be the arm, the arm, always the fucking arm. Sigurd, this is an illusion, mm -hmm. a trick. Leave with me now and return to England with me. Our people need us. No, I am no one in that world. I am somebody here, powerful, capable, a god. Here I may live forever. 
Akira cannot die. Perhaps he fears death. Did did I just cows die? Family die. You must die. That's... The only thing that never dies is the reputation of the one who's died. For better or worse. In here, you have no reputation. But out there, it's not too late. Every day, the same empty war, the same hollow victory, spilling blood that tastes of water and smells of grass. You have known real battle, real glory, but this is not it. And you know, he knows you it know too. This. Yeah. I know you do. That's why it's always the same right arm. This is mine. Brother, it is time to leave. Mind telling him that it's Am not Am I there. destined to follow you everywhere? To the end of my life? All right. We go. No, you stay. I do not give you leave to go. Odin? Oh, that's new. So is Odin... Maybe Odin's not really a phantom. Maybe he's part of the first Civ. That that would be an interesting twist. Why leave this place? A glory you fought so hard to find. Walk with me. I am humbled to walk with you, Eivor. Your reputation is a song warriors will sing forever. Damn controller. You are the wolf-kissed one who lingered at the edge of death, yet fought back. So is this a review of my life? Spilled the raven wine of battle to paint whole kingdoms red. All right. You have killed kings and crowned them as you desired, bowing to none. stood tall where your brother stumbled, yet still you came to his aid. Do it again, too. Oh, it's Varen's axes at my hip, not my sword. I you have felled that. many great foes in your brief time. You have earned your place here, Eivor. Seize it. Now we're gonna fight. Stand aside. My people need me. I have given you everything you wanted. Everything you needed. You gave me nothing. It was all me. Yet I cleared your path. I guided your axe. You were a fly, buzzing in my ear. How dare you deny me? Everything you believe in stirs before you. Yet, you question all. You question the very gods. The thing about truth is it doesn't mind questions. Fight me! Do not diminish yourself! Your call <laughs> is nothing but a dream. It's nothing but a dream. A dream is as real as anything in this world. Do dreams not inspire? Do dreams not make us fear? Do they not push men to their greatest glories? Then I am done with dreaming. Interesting. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to lose this fight because I got no moves. I've got full adrenaline. He doesn't even have a health bar. 
Let go of the axe. Fight upon my command. We'll pull me back again. that time. Damn, I just bought that through my straight arm. Tell me again. Can I change it? So I know he has control over my axe, but what do I do about it? Defeat, I get a little bit more of my powers back and my moves and stuff. Switch hands, interesting. I 
wonder if I'll eventually get a different weapon that's a not not an axe. Oh, maybe that's... Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. How do I unequip? Unequip. Equipment can be upgraded. Oh, that's not upgrade. Equip. Um. Three types of both. I don't care. literally doesn't let me un unequip. Why could I not do that before? Take up your axe, wield like a true warrior. You will take up your axe. Sigurd, are you... are you with me? No. 
Sigurd! He's still inside. Ah! The hanged one awakes. Feet upon the ground once more. Eivor! Be careful! Vasim? What is this? Vasim is the father? Oh, sir Eivor. Let me get a better look at you. Leave him be, Vasim. For too long I stared at the sun. It blinded me to the truth. That it was you. It was you I wanted all along. Did you track us here? Like a cowardly fox concealed in the brush. What brush? There's nothing but snow. You widowed my destiny, Wolfkist. You broke all my hopes. He's mad, Eivor. Silence him. Come, Eivor. Come save your crippled prince of dead races. <laughs> First off. Are you hurt? It is nothing. Go. Kill that background. Why can I not move easily? It's so painful. You must suffer a thousand times what I suffered. What is this about? My son, Eivor. This is about my son. One of the people I killed was his son. Forgiveness is impossible. We shared so much in England. Thought and blood together. Oh, he doesn't have a health bar. Maybe I can't kill him. Into the wellspring of your memory. Oh, I, I tracked him. Nice. What well done, me? Speak your grievance. Show yourself. I do not wish to fight with you. Kill me also because he doesn't have a health bar. Avor did say he didn't want to fight, so let's let it happen. Oh, he's not doing much damage, is he? Am I supposed to just let him deal damage? Because this is going to take forever. Turned into a glut for punishment because plot, literally. Ah. 
Wait. What the fuck? I'm supposed to. What? I don't understand. What the hell are you supposed to do? He doesn't have a health bar. And I can't climb, I can't hide or get away. Are you hurt? It is nothing. Go! Kill that background! I don't understand. A thousand times what I suffered. What is this about? My son, Eivor. This is about my son! You speak nonsense, Basim. Forgiveness is impossible. We Unless... share so much in England. Fought and bled together. Dig, Eivor. Into the wellspring of your memory. Maybe you have a help on that I just can't Show see. I do not wish to fight with you. through the wall. Why is this different? <laughs> the kiss of a wolf takes my prize! Of course! Yeah. Maybe this time it's different because I was prize. attempting to kill. So maybe. Oh! You spout nonsense! Like an alehouse drunk! I think you that are to them. Far. So be it. You will not die in peace. You will never see your home or your people again. <laughs> Maybe now. Let's make this more interesting. We'll drag Sigurd into the fray. Ah, oh, crap, Baskets. Howard, face me. Fight me here. <laughs> we gotta definitely take that. Gotta rebuild my potions. Be on your guard, Sigurd! <laughs> I 
Alright, good. Back to six. Yeah, there's no way I'm losing this fight. Not if it's for real. Sigurd! Be careful! He's coming for you! Justice bringer, you were always so kind, but you chose the wrong side. <gasps> nice try, bitch. I am your prize, Basim. Come. You are indeed. <laughs> no, no. What's he, what's he gonna find in that memory? I assume it's a memory. In that storage. <laughs> Second one? Big smack. There you go. Oh, no. That's what Sigurd was doing. Good deal. Oh. Sigurd! Stop this thing! Now it's fire! Sigurd! Are we going to end up killing them both? Does he still live? He does. But in darkness. Good. Bastard. For how long had Basin been planning this treachery? I dare not guess. Gods! Am I to be hounded by a parade of blood-minded traitors the whole of my life? <laughs> there is no end to this. You have something you want to say? Say it. I. Uh, I need some time to breathe. Let me see. Hold a moment, then. All right. That man's anger, his rage. It had a familiar sting that I. I cannot place. He was raving, Sigurd. Without sense or reason. Paid no mind. I am not mad, Eivor. These things I see and feel, I know they are true. I know, brother. Now more than ever, you always spoke true. We should cast our eyes towards home. It is a long journey and I am... not well. Home. Eivor. On our journey here, I had much time to think. The ecstasies and the agonies of our friendship. I cannot return to England with you. That is not my home. Not now. What, what are, you are you saying? I know about you and Ranvi. My lovers tryst in spite of me. I should challenge you for such a betrayal. But I'm. I'm not fit for such a fight. I. Uh... I wonder if this, so if this scene would have changed if I had not if I had turned her down. All? I wonder. Maybe. Do you recall the day we stood before Edwin, searching for the Saka Stone? You struck Basin. You lashed out at me. You made a fool of us all. That is not a leader I wish to follow into death and glory. You were being secretive then. Foolish, I thought. But my grievances go back further still. You stole my father's riches. My haste to leave, I should have stopped you then. A true leader would have stopped that thought before it took form. You were selfish. This is not a decision I make lightly, Eivor. You are family. You were my drink. What do you mean, were? But here, our paths must diverge. Uh, Brother, no. please stay. Your place is with us, in England. 
Our home is your home. Yeah. We're the brothers. My road forward has been a muddy one. Slick with blood and tears. But we can reach its end together. Let us face new foes and greater glories together. Yeah. It's always been Since a Since my captivity, I felt you were cold and distant. But here your words glow with heart fire and kindness. All right. Yeah? All right. I will come. But only if I may counsel you from time to time to be better than you are. Fair enough. I expect nothing less. <laughs> I don't think he would actually go for it. Maybe he will. Maybe yet yeah, something will happen. You have a stormy look. Years ago, before we left for England, I saw a vision. A vision that foretold a betrayal. That I would betray you. I refused to believe it. I would never do such a thing, I told myself. But in the years since, oh. I have robbed you of your dreams. Of England, of Valhalla. If you feel I have wronged you, brother, I will make it right. We cannot unweave our fates, Eivor. All is laid before us, from the day we are born. To be angry at this would be like... <laughs> like wrestling the ocean. A pointless struggle. We two racket ravens. <laughs> what a saga we have inscribed together. A tale for the ages. As it was foretold, trophy unlocked. Good deal. Playing in the present day now? Damn, it has been a long time. I kind of forgot about it. Actually, a couple times, I was wondering when we were going to play back in the present. But. Because most games, the previous games, for the most part at least, they would shift between the two. Oh, wait. What Bex, I'm coming out. Steady, Layla. Were you watching my feed? What the hell was all that? I think that was the solution to our problem. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Desmond. Desmond? What about him? Dude's dead. Right? He was just a bartender before he joined us. Not even a very good one. <laughs> That's Damn. when he learned his real purpose. He was like a... I don't know, like a singularity, you know, a vanishing point. All of human history seemed to converge on him. In 2012, the sun threw off a mass coronal ejection so large, it should have wrecked all life on Earth. I remember. I worked at Abstergo then. It was Desmond who saved us. He knew how to stop it. Abstergo claimed credit for that. Something about their satellite network. That's bullshit. It mm -hmm. was Desmond. He pulled the switch that saved the world. But that switch is still on. Still generating a magnetic field. One that's growing stronger every day. The temple Eivor found. That's where the field originates. Exactly. And it's been running for eight years. Getting stronger oh. and stronger. It'll be dangerous now. Heat, radiation... Doesn't matter. We have to fix it. Shut it down. No, no, no. Slow it down. It's still protecting us. Yeah, I was gonna say, if you shut it down, we lose our protection. All of this is starting to make sense. Everything I've done, everything I've learned, it led me here to this moment. You'll need the staff for this one. For protection. Otherwise, you won't make it past the first gate. Right, of course. Okay. I'm Are ready. Are you talking about the staff from Odyssey? Okay. I'll pack the van. 
and I'll contact our ship. It can be in Boston Harbor by tomorrow night. Oh, you're talking about a literal ship. Thanks, Bex. I'm gonna sit. I see. Oh, thank God. Oh, well, I was gonna wrap it up, but I might as I mean, might as well keep going now. Alright, because I might be able to. I think we're almost done. Something. Wait, what was it? Something about Cassandra? If we actually met Cassandra, this means that I have as an animus host met a previous animus host in the simulation. Could Layla have noticed something odd the animus brought on by Cassandra's sudden appearance? Not only that, could the staff have sensed Layla's presence as a current keeper? I have so many questions. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. How do I talk to Therese? Thanks for keeping it steady in there. You surf this thing better than anyone I know. That's not true, is it? Well, nearly. Not almost. Be careful out there. And come back know. in one piece. I think Desmond Thanks, might Bex. be better. If anyone could ride the animus better, it would have been him. Maybe, uh, what was his name? Maybe uh, Subject 16? Can I go for a swim? No, but I can get all wet. Oh, there's the van. I was just gonna ask that. I'm ready. It's a long way to Beantown. Hop in. Next question, do I have a hidden blade? Wait, so that thing is still running, does that mean Basim is still being kept Sean, alive? I'm here. Ah, good. Your signal's already a little wobbly. Are you inside? Not yet, but there's a hundred feet of ice above me. All right, we may lose touch when you push through, so remember what we talked about. Watch your meters carefully, the radiation especially, and keep the staff yep. close. Oh, right. that is a staff Got it. Odyssey. Standing by. Now, artifact of the first Civ, I believe. It, it's been a while since I played Odyssey. Zawahoe Nakwat, Unzme Borturwan di Quarte. Ul solas fras hunakudi de Unzum huraz, des dere has, zo humsi. I'm in. Good. And remember, do not cut the machine off. Just throw it down. The field it generates, but still protect the earth. I hear you. But how do I slow it down? Ask the question. The elevator still works. Ah, seventy-five thousand years. What's another millennium or two? <laughs> it's getting hotter already. Yes, by our reckoning, it's going to go up by about sixteen degrees Celsius. Oh. How does it draw so much power? Tectonics is our best theory. The movements of the Earth's crust, the churning lava beneath, huge source of energy. That's tech humans should have. Energy, not pieces of Eden. Well, when all this is over, we can get a startup going, you know? Get a little by a van, just the three of us. Shit, you're breaking up, Sean. Say that again, please. You're breaking up. Forget it. I'll call you when I'm topside. Why don't you try calling us when you're topside? Something like that. Here we go. 